The Fox 23 severe weather team is finding out the steps to take to make sure you're prepared for the dangerously cold temperatures expected in the next 24 hours. Fox 23's Jenny Young spoke with officials at FEMA today. She joins us live with how to keep your family safe. Jenny. Tiffany, IMSA told us that their drivers and ambulances are prepared for treacherous conditions, but it's everyone else they say they want to be prepared for the cold to avoid any unnecessary trips to the emergency room. Up, wear several layers. IMSA says the more layers, the better. Make sure the inner layers are warm and the outer layers protect you from the wind. And don't forget your head and your hands. Also be sure and wear, you know, hats and scarves, gloves. And for the snowfall we're expecting over the weekend, Work boots, anything that's waterproof, that would be best. If you do get any kind of clothing that is wet, you're going to want to change out of them as quickly as possible because wet and cold is not good for the body. They also told us it really doesn't take a long time out in the cold before hypothermia can set in. These are the signs to look for. Shivering, um, confusion, and people can even become unconscious. They told us that it's people with special medical needs that are especially vulnerable during this time of the year. I have a list I'm putting together for Fox 23 News at 5 of what you need to do and if you have a medical need, according to IMSA. I'm also talking to people around town about how they're preparing for this weekend. Reporting live, covering news that matters, Jenny Young, Fox 23 News.